Kelly Green, product manager for XLR Boost, coming at you live from beautiful Goshen, Indiana. And today we're gonna show you some great features on the 29 XLR E Micro Boost. So we're now on the exterior of the 29 XLR E, which is a micro boost, which is a travel trailer built by Forest River in the division of XLR. We're in the front and I'm gonna show you some of these great features that we have. So starting in the front, you got a battery disconnect. So that's the heart of your, your unit and your 12 volt system. It's gonna have radio memory draws and little draws here and there. You can actually flip that disconnect so it's not drawing off the battery. And then you've got a 200 watt standard solar panel on the roof that actually is putting a charge into this battery to keep it in tip top condition. And we'll show you a little bit more of that when we get on the inside. Moving down the, uh, the outside, you've got a, a magnet that holds up your compartment door so it's not having to fight with that and put things in one handed and you've got real good storage up underneath the, the front of this for all your bag chairs or water or what you, you wanna put in there. Moving down on the, uh, we use the edge awning by, by Lippert and we do that really purposeful because they actually have LED lights that are on the arms. So when the arms come out, your LED light is actually away from where you're sitting and camping. And, and what draws light is bugs. So blue actually distracts less bugs and it's actually away from you. So you're not having to swat at bugs. So that's one improved feature on it. The other feature on it is it actually has a grommet override. So heaven forbid that you ever have a, a power failure, but you can actually then take a 7 16 inch wrench and you can actually bring your uh, awning in mechanically and actually have it stored sure and sound and know that, that you can still continue on with your camping trip or, or get home. So moving down, we're gonna talk about our SureStep uh, Moride uh, step system. So we had this last year, but we made a few upgrades to it. So it's still, still light and easy to bring up and down. But what we improved is we actually put uh, Moride improved and there used to be tabs that went through your hair that you used to have to pull out. Now you just got a lever here and then you automatically adjust it and still easy peasy up and down. And then also for this year, we went to the nice uh, blue boost, recognizable laser etched, a uh, little bit of branding and a little bit of props for ourselves. Um, friction hinge door on the outside. So a little bit of wind, it's not gonna go and slam up against your coach. Um, give it a good push because those doors are cambered. You wanna give it a good solid smash so that you actually get your locking mechanism to, to close all the way. You got two good speakers on the outside. We give you both a hot and a cold shower. So you got both out here with actually a, a hose that you can hear and rinse yourself off and, and get all the grime. And then uh, you've got your uh, city uh, water and you also have your uh, black tank flush right there. So if you ever get any toilet paper and you feel like your probes are getting a little clogged up, you put the hose there, that's actually got a sprayer into your black tank and will knock all those things off. If for some reason your black tank flush, I'll give you a little bit of tips from my 10 years or plus of camping. Go bag yourself a $1.99 bag of ice and on the trip home, just pour it down the toilet and let that ice rush around and knock all those probes clean too. That's also a great way of getting that done. So here's one of our uh, awesome features that we have. So this is our tankless water heater, 66,000 BTUs of heat. So as long as you've got a water source and you've got LP, you've got hot water. And we're gonna show you how that uh, monitor works on the inside, because it's very similar to sleep number bed and you're gonna love it. 35,000 BTU furnace. So on those chilly nights, you've got a, a heating source that actually comes from the, the flooring level and out of the cabinets, out of ducts. Um, on this model, we've got uh, 5,100 pound axles. So, and then if you get a good shot of my spring hanger and my shackles here, we actually use a Norco frame, which is different than our competitors. So it's an engineered frame and it's actually huck bolted together, which is used in uh, planes and automotive, uh, locomotives in the, the train and semi business. So much well-engineered frame, e-coded and huck bolted together. So you're getting definitely a, a top 
frame in the industry and that's one of our extra built items and then new for this year <coughs> is also a tire pressure monitoring system. So you can see that little yellow tire indicator comes with a, a monitor that you can put up in your tow vehicle and uh, actually senses your tire pressure while you're going up. And so again, another added safety feature that we're putting on the XLR boosts, both uh, 102 wides and micro boosts. So our whole product line will have tire pressure monitoring system for model year 2023. And then uh, for our pet lovers, we can't ever go without talking about our leash latch. So if you got a, a pet and you wanted them to enjoy the outside without chasing all the other patronage uh, in the campground around, you've got the ability to put them on a 2,500 pound D-ring and, and keep them safe. So those are the great features of the uh, 29 XLRE, and now we're gonna move to the interior. We talked about the 200 watt solar panel that's up on the roof. This is the monitor panel, the 30 amp monitor panel that comes with the 200 watt solar panel that's on the roof. And that uh, solar panel on the roof is roughly between eight and a half to, to nine amps. So this is a 30 amp monitor panel. So you can add two more panels before you gotta incur any more costs or to have to upgrade this panel if you wanted to increase your solar ability and add batteries to the front of this unit if you're doing a lot of the uh, off the grid camping. Swiveling around, you got your TV prep area. So you got your outlet and your hookups. And then we also provide already the, the 200 by 200 uh, VESA. We're not in the, the competition with Walmart and Target. So whatever TV that you want for your liking, we prep it, you go you go and buy your TV. Um, on the, uh, the radio, we're also using uh, Furion that you're gonna see. We use a Furion suite of appliances so that we try to stay with one brand so that you either can call us or call them and we both have great service and running you through and, and using the same products too so that we're very familiar with them. So you got a, a very packed small radio, but it actually puts out a really good punch. So you got two speakers on the inside, two speakers on the outside, which both are zoned. So if you want to just be playing the inside or just playing the outside, you got a button to switch back and forth. You can uh, HDMI to it, you can Bluetooth to it. So very, very functional and uh, effective radio. Also uh, on uh, boost in this uh, price point that you're not gonna see on other of our competitors is a monitor panel. So we put all these nice switches that are labeled all in uh, one area and uh, so also give you a blue light on your water pump so that you can actually know when it's actively on rather than just listening for it. But it just gives you one nice central location for those switches rather than having them all over the unit and having to go search for them. And then we move into the uh, the 30 inch Furion fireplace, which is a 5,000 BTU fireplace. So on those chilly nights, if you've got uh, electricity that you're already paying for the campground, rather than paying for your LP and firing up your furnace, just turn on your, your fireplace that will take those uh, chills off those nights. So another great uh, extra built feature that we offer in the uh, XLR Micro Boost. So moving to the uh, to the main sleeping area, um, you got a couple options. Your, your first option really is in when you're in just chill mode during the day, you've got a very nice comfortable seating area with uh, end tables looking directly at your, your TV for viewing and just all your features in your, your ambiance. If for some, you got a, a child or even adult that's smaller that wants to just take a nap, you again, you wanna grab a hold of the actual vinyl because if you grab a hold of the frame, you're bringing it all and you can lay that down and you just got kind of like a day bed if you wanna take a quick nap. If it's uh, nighttime and you wanna go into full sleeping mode, you got your latches on each side that you're gonna pop. And then you get your legs. Bring your mattress out. And then we really worked on the uh, strength this year of this platform and, and its durability. Because that's 270 pounds of a very athletic built guy. 
flopping iron on that, and that is built to support. So another improvement that we made in the 29 XLRE for this year. Moving, you got a kitchen slide. So two improvements that we actually have made in this model in regards to just uh, getting more natural lighting in it. One, we added the window that's up front next to the bed so you get cross ventilation. But then we also added the window to get natural light into your kitchen area. So it actually brightened this area up. This year, we went through all new wallboard, all new wood green, new accent, new uh, backsplash, still have our stainless steel sink, residential faucet, full suite of Furion appliances. So microwave with a turntable, range vent with a light and a fan, glass top with a very durable and easy to clean, great for your three burner, added countertop space with the grate. You got the nice feature of your LEDs on your 17 inch oven. When you actually turn those on, they go from blue to red. So another safety feature that you know the gas is flowing when it's red. And if you actually forget, then you know to actually turn it off and turn it to blue. And then a nice space with adjustable shelves that will fit even a turkey for Thanksgiving when you have the family over. Um, before we go into the bathroom, I want to talk about the refrigerator. So the Freerion refrigerator is also part of that suite of appliances. Um, it's 12 volt, so you can run it while you're going up and down the road because it's working off your solar panel and your battery. <clears throat> it also has this great feature that it has a dial in here that at night, if you don't want to hear the compressor run, you can actually turn it all the way to off. That's what we call off the grid mode. And so the compressor isn't running, it basically turns it into a cooler. And then when you're getting your stuff out in the morning, you just pop it back on and you're ready to go for the, for the day. So again, for this year, we upgraded our doors to three panel doors in uh, black accents with black hardware. Same with the kitchen cabinets. We, uh, we put black hardware on them for good, good accents. And then moving into the bathroom. So this year, we actually have accent walls. So we took that same backsplash that we upgraded. We also are putting them into the into the wall to give you a little bit more uh, home feel and, and pop in your bathroom. So stainless steel sink, awesome size shower. You know, I'm roughly six one, six one and a half. I used to say six two, but I'm getting older and shrinking. So, you know, I've got good good head height with the with the skylight plenty of room to be able to wash myself down and do everything that I need to do um, in this bathroom. So I always refer to this as a equivalent to a sleep number bed, but it actually has a, a dial on it. So rather than having to mix the hot and the cold when you're in the shower, once you actually know whether you're 102 or 95, or if you're my wife and you want it all the way at 124 so that you're coming out red hot, um, you know what your number is, just like a sleep number bed. So no longer are you in here fumbling around with the, the faucet. You actually just pick your number and you've got hot water. So as long as you got a water source and you got LP, this is a wonderful and beautiful actual solution to RVing and it's, it's a, a nice extra built feature. So one thing I can say about the, the 29 XLRE that I, I can't go over enough is for a micro boost with a 13 foot garage. Look at all the storage that you get in here. You get plenty of sleeping area. You got the blackout shades in the front, the stainless steel sinks, but you got storage, 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 storage. Did I say that it has plenty of storage? The 29 XLRE does not lack storage. Um, and what's uh, beautiful about the 29 XLRE is that it also is under 7,000 pounds uh, UVW. So it's half ton towable with a 13 foot garage. And that's the, the other very priceless thing of being a toy hauler. Let's go look at the garage. So moving into the end of the garage, you've got 13 feet from the edge all the way to the front 
but we also gave you a nice little entertaining area in here. So you got an extra countertop in here for uh, helmets, drinks, entertaining while you're back here playing cards at the dinette, and then overhead cabinets. And then if you don't want the bugs, you've actually got a screen that's magnetic that pops onto the hoop and keeps the bugs from coming in and out of your garage also that has a zip in the middle to get in and out. Again, you got a TV prep back here in the back. The garage is weighted for 2,000 pounds. You got a nice table that when you want to go into sleep mode, you take the, the feet of the table down, pop it down, move your cushion so you got a full bed here and a full bed above. So again, we call this <clears throat> a sit and sleep and a sleep and store. So it's stored above. Two key features on this also, if you ever wanna just move these out of the way, we've actually put them on a bracket with wing nuts underneath there. So four wing nuts, and you can take that all the way off the wall. If you want it up against the wall, take all your cushions off, store them up in the front, flip your platforms up and hook them with your hooks. And you're then in storage mode, and that's how you roll your toys in and out. Getting the table out of the way. Which look how big that table is. Plenty of eating space, plenty of area to play cards. Now we're back out to our party deck. So very, very easy, very light. But what we've done this year with More Ride and, and the, the end of last year is we actually made this stack almost an inch thinner than a lot of our competitors. You see how it actually folds in on each other and has a magnet that actually holds it together so that when you pull this out, <clears throat> you got a button here that you actually push and it telescopes. And then that's how you put it into patio mode. Again, magnet. And easy peasy. So, I mean, less than a couple minutes, you're back here. You can put chairs out here, relax back here. You might have a beach out there. You might have a pond out there. You might just have nature and, and just a peace and quiet of, of camping. But that's one thing that a, a toy hauler affords you. It's very versatile. It's got room separation and, and really creates a, a lot of fond areas and memories for uh, camping. Kelly Green from XLR Boost coming at you live from Goshen, Indiana. We just went through the 29 XLRE Micro Boost. I hope you enjoyed your time and all the great features. And we look forward for you coming and looking at us at forestriverinc.com forward slash XLR. Come look at all of our products. Happy camping. <laughs>